from the Center for the Arts studio, this is your AUTV News Break. I'm Ethan Jenkins. Thanks for tuning in. In campus news on April 4th, Ashland University's Environmental Lecture Series will wrap up its 2024 programming. The final event will feature the Director of Natural Resources at Cleveland Metro Parks, Jennifer Greaser. The talk will take place inside Ronk Lecture Hall and begin at 7.30 p.m. A video lecture option is also available via sign-up on ashland.edu. In local news, Ashland City Council has agreed to a tax incentive for a planned hotel in the Pump House District. The council approved a 100% property tax abatement over 15 years. The target date for the hotel to be opened is two years away, meaning the tax will not be due until 2041. Home to Suites by Hilton will build the hotel featuring 94 rooms along with multiple conference rooms to boost downtown Ashland business. And finally, in state news, cases of the bird flu have been found in Ohio cattle. The ill cows are housed at a dairy farm in northwest Ohio and are still awaiting positive confirmation from the U.S. Department of Agriculture. Cattle in five states have tested positive for the flu in 2024, with one human testing positive in Texas as well. No Ohio residents have yet to be impacted by this. And now a look at our five-day weather forecast here in Ashland, Ohio. Today we are seeing rainy skies with a high of 45 and a low of 33. Cloudy weather will take over the skies on Friday and Saturday with a high of 41 on Friday and 47 on Saturday. Sunny skies will begin next week with a high of 54 on Sunday and a high of 64 on Monday for the solar eclipse. And that is it for this AUTV news break. Be sure to follow us across all social media at AUTV. I'm Ethan Jenkins. Thanks for watching.